another training and that exercise is speaking in tongues most of us speak in tongues and it is very loud there are some places if you are staying in the uk for instance you can't speak these tongues you speak here this is only these makodi tongues that you speak here because your neighbor will will, will sue you you pay pay a fine by the time you have paid one thousand pounds it means you are you are actually paying your neighbor's salary i'm saying you should be able to pray in tongues and the person sitting close to you doesn't know that one that is not if you are fighting you shout if you want to release decrees it must and jesus caused the victory and the disciples had it so he didn't cause the victory in his house and you and you die now your root his disciples had him but there are many things you can do indoors in my work with god let me tell you a secret when i'm at home i don't pray out and this happened because i went to visit my sister one day in an environment where i couldn't shout meanwhile i was coming from makoti we used to shout at the satan shout at darkness Holy Papa. then i now went there she said young man I understand you like prayer but here you can't shout here so i had to discover something new at first when i started praying soft i wasn't feeling it on my heart the way the shout was but when i stayed on it i found out this was how jesus prayed so you might see me in the hall praying and it doesn't look like i'm praying i'm praying in my heart i'm praying in tongues inside Although if you come very close, you will know anyway. That prayer I'm praying inside, eh? It, I know the reaction is producing. I know. I know when I pray to a point where I can, I can make you stumble from that seat. I know. I, I feel every, every movement. Every movement that is taking place on the inside. Do you feel your spirit? If, it, if your spirit rises, do you know? Do you know when you have prayed until you have authority to heal the sick? Do you know how it feels? If somebody wants to put charm in your office, you that you are a doctor, and you have, you know that that's what the person wants to do. Do you know what to do so that the person comes with the charm, the charm will catch the person, turn your spirit. When you do, the people that you were afraid of will become afraid of you. When you do so that i can show you some things so that's why when you see me i don't pray loud until there's an unction that comes on me i pray inside soft i can be looking at you i'm praying looking at you i'm praying what is happening on my inside is much more than what is happening outside and i'm studying the movement i'm studying when he will rise up because i've exercised it and i will yet exercise it so paul says that i pray in tongues more than you all i work in a certain department in the oil industry where you are on the go when i was in lagos from 5 a.m in the morning you are trying to make your way through hold up to get to work so what i discovered is that in order for me to maintain my christian life i had to prayer and my life must be one so when i was in the bus trying to make it to the office i look for a way to pray so that i'm not disturbing i'm not a nuisance to my neighbor so that hold up because they were constructing that road so i'm going to be in that bus for four hours so when you start by five o'clock you are going to finish to the end of the road by nine then i prayed for four hours but you will not know then i go to the office i'm so sensitive it is through some of those experiences i say okay to generate this level of sensitivity is four hours prayer i did many spiritual experiments and i took readings from my spirit hey, this this sensitivity came after four hours okay i took readings many different types of readings because i was stuck on that road for five years i used that road the construction of my two road towards maza maza towards first tack towards ablado towards trade fair vox that road that road i use it to take readings from my spirit until i now discovered what i need to do in the spirit for me to rise up 
it's an excess it's a deliberate thing don't think don't think you will gain any form of mileage you will stumble into it no it's something it's a product of exercise so i got used to praying on the go so i can wake up from my bed and what you see me doing is that i'm strolling checking something and that checking i will do it for two hours you think he's just wasting two hours hey, um i built it inside so as long as i'm breathing air i can pray prayer so some people ask when do you pray i live on the charger when do you charge i live on it i connect the charger i live on it i live on the charger you exercise your spirit until nothing takes you unawares again i've seen the power of what works inside of us i've seen it there's power in you please help me tell your neighbor there is power power in you sometimes i see some of your faces when you come to see me after service and there's fear on your eyes i i, I wonder how long will it take him to know that there is power in you there is power in you there is power in you there's power in you there's power in you can we pray that god will teach us the things the things that cannot be taught those are spiritual things it, it cannot be taught it can only be experienced you know them because you experience them teach us the things that cannot be taught teach us the things that cannot be taught teach us the things that cannot be taught things that cannot be taught i call celibacan de breza villa monde bruso korea bakamali Escombre, vavala co prescu vasamina, ai campela cosqueta lisco balembre. La bobo simandele, babrosco tomo coria. That God will teach us the things that cannot be taught, spiritual things that can only be experienced. You know them because you experience them. You know them because you handle them in the spirit. That God will take us there. That's when you become a strong man. A strong man. You know when to take your journey. You know when it is time to stand. When it's time to sit. When it's time to walk away. When it's time to run. You know it. You know it. And the moment you move, that's when the disaster will come. Because there's a man that has been made strong in his spirit by the Holy Ghost. The same way you go to the gym to exercise your body. And you come out, your stomach that was protruding, you it it goes back to shape and the eight eight contours of muscle on your stomach begins to appear because you have been in the gym for a long time trying to restore your shape that's the same thing that is required for us to be able to maximize the capacity of our spirit teach us the things that cannot be taught make us wise by the holy ghost Show us things that men rush and never get to see. Powers that have not yet been explored. 